What is up, lads and ladettes? I cap you seventy seven here, and what is a yaush? Well, uh, let me just tell you what a yaush is. Yaush is a gaming network that is um, I'm not gonna say like Machinima because there are so many things that differ in between each network, but it's basically a little baby Machinima, kinda. They have um different, they have different channels. I want to say, like, you know, Machinima has Machinima Realm, Machinima Sports, Machinima Respawn. Well, uh, Yaush has several other channels for, you know, first person shooters, RPGs, let's plays, sports games. Uh, I can't remember their names right now because, uh, they're not, I'm not real familiar with them. But, um, uh, yeah, you saw that little, uh, intro that Yaush gave me because, uh, I'm a, I'm a Yaush member. And, uh, this game isn't about the gameplay at all. It's well, it's it is about the gameplay and it isn't. And uh, you saw that right there. That was terrible. Uh, it's about the gameplay and it isn't at the same time. And what I mean by that is I get a terrible score and I camp as hard as I probably can because uh, camping's boring to me and I get in antsy and I have to move. But I was playing with my friend Andrew and uh, he is not. He's a beast Halo player. But Call of Duty is like um, Spanish English with him. Uh, he he cannot branch over from Halo to Call of Duty. It's like an alien language to him. Uh, he just does not understand how Call of Duty works. Uh, so we usually play, and uh, his favorite gun is the Wa 2000 with an ACOG. Don't ask me why. That's just his gun. Uh, and the reason I uploaded this is because. The reason it's not about the game, it is about the gameplay, is because of how many times and how many fails there are in this game. Uh, as you saw, that was a fail. Like, when I tried to blow those guys up on that tower and I ended up blowing myself up, that was terrible. But, uh, I don't really have anything to talk about yet. Uh, I was going to talk a little bit mo about Modern Warfare 3, but, uh, COD XP is out. So much stuff about Modern Warfare 3 is out. I think I'm going to make that a whole nother video. I'm not going to talk about any of this. I'm mainly going to talk about Yaush. Uh, as far as I know, ya Yaush has under 2,000 members. And uh, that's a really, like, I feel privileged to be a part of it. Uh, because Yaush is a gaming network such as Machinima. And, uh, like, Machinima has... I'm gonna say over, way over 100,000 users. Uh, I don't want to be wrong. I don't want to give you some ridiculous numbers, but it's probably over 100,000 users. Uh, watch this. This is awesome. I was camping the stairs and I noticed that guy died. So uh, I blow that guy up. As soon as I come out of my RC car, what is that guy doing? And uh, uh, I don't really, uh, at, at first I didn't understand what had killed me, but. Uh, Here's my RC car. Goes around the side of the thing, kills that guy. I don't know how this guy that planned the claymore didn't see me. And then uh, my Sam turret hates me, so it decides to end my life. And uh, that was pretty awesome. Right? So there's three fails at once. Uh, two fails because the guys didn't see me. And then a third fail because my Sam turret was like, you know what? I hate you. You always got me shooting down stuff. And I'm tired of it, man. I'm tired of not getting able to kill anybody. And uh, I just I don't want to live anymore. And yeah, he killed us both. And, uh, I love Treyarch, because I was shooting at that spy plane with my Sam turret. Awesome, isn't it? And, uh, anyway, so, I feel really privileged, pri excuse me, privileged to be a part of Yaush, um, at such an early stage in its life, because, uh, I haven't really tried to get into Machinima, uh, I haven't really been on their website, I'm sure I could, but, uh, I got into Yaush, and they gave me that little intro, so, uh, to say I'm a a Yaush member. Uh, not partnered yet, but we shall see. Uh, I'm trying to think of the channel names, and I, just, I can't think of it, uh, but Yaush is basically, I'm going to continue comparing it to Machinima. There are so many differences, like, uh, I don't know if Machinima does, but Yaush has a 24-hour chat room, and, uh, there are always people on that. Uh, the reason I said it has under 2,000 users is because, uh, the most I've ever seen on the website itself at one time was uh, 640, uh, around that, and uh, 
here coming up uh, is one of my favorite fails and it's one of my favorite fails and I even added some little uh, a little music to it so uh, I'm just gonna stop talking about Yash for a second I'm gonna just uh, be quiet here And, uh, yeah, how wonderful, right? My RC car decided to go underneath the map. And, uh, when I was playing the game itself, I'm glad that worked in theater, but this is captured in theater. But when I was playing the game myself, whenever I, uh, whenever I, uh, like, put out my, whenever I took out the radio controller for the RC XD, uh, it spawned on the other side of the map, and I was driving on top of the ground. Then another, f but then when I did it in theater, uh, I was under the ground. I don't understand that, but, uh, you know what? Whatever. Model for 3 comes out in a couple months, and maybe there won't be so much BS in that game. But, uh, yeah, I'm doing terrible in this game, but there was just so much weird stuff that I had to upload it. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Um, thank you to Mediafire, by the way. So I can get all these songs without having to buy them on iTunes. I probably shouldn't have said anything like that, because then iTunes would be like, you can't use them. But uh, you can't control everything, Apple. It's hard not to, but you can't control everything. But uh, keep a lookout for me. I'm getting an intro pretty soon, having one of the guys at Yaosh make it. Uh, it should be a pretty good intro. Uh, right now, the intro I had is uh, an intro provided to all Yash members, so if they do pick you to become a member of their their uh, smaller community, uh, and the way you get into Yash, uh, you go to the website and do the whole thing, but really the way you get into your Yash is uh, being unique, because uh, by now there's so many, I love that was the most fun I've had in a while, the RC car is jumping it off that, but uh, you have to realize that uh, being a, a YouTube commentator isn't unique anymore. Thanks, teammate. Um, <laughs> deflecting my RC car. Uh, being a YouTube commentator isn't unique anymore. Uh, there are so many more people now than what there were doing YouTube stuff. Uh, so you're kind of just a statistic now. So to be a good YouTube commentator, to be a commentator that someone wants to watch, and, uh, get out of final stand, noob. Suck on my balls. Just one. You don't even deserve both. But, the re like, how to become a good YouTube video, how to become someone, something that someone wants to watch, is, uh, being unique. If you just say, okay, this is a gameplay commentary, this is who I am, this is what I'm doing, this is the gun I'm using, these are the perks I'm using, this is the map I'm on. I mean, everybody does that. And, uh, some of those are, like, really easy like I'm using the Mac or I've extended mags it says that right above where my ammunition is I mean you guys know that you've all played the Enemy game you all know what map this is I hate this map so much but you all know what map this is I mean you have played this game you understand the basics and you don't want to hear someone talk about it as if it was Friendly like RCX the first time deploy. playing it I mean other than off. like some series are made for that. Like watching Randy's, that is a series that is made to make you better at Call of Duty. That is a series especially designed for what I just said. Uh, I don't remember what my final score was. But I'm pretty sure that it wasn't very good. Uh, we ended up winning actually through all those shenanigans. Uh, I copy 77 out. Uh, check out Yash.com. Bye, lads and ladettes.